I see a lot of golfers, high handicappers, low handicappers, young and old, struggling to strike their irons. But there is something that we can all learn from serial flusher Colin Morikawa. Hey everybody, Peter Finch, and I am excited to have you here with me. All you're gonna to need to practice this simple technique and these simple thoughts is gonna be a short iron. I have an eight iron here and some alignment sticks. If you have a grass range, absolutely amazing, but you can do this on any matted range as well. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. It is all for free. And if you hit the bell, you will get notified of when a new video is posted. Now, a few things that you need to know about Colin Morikawa's swing, it is not essential that you copy these facets of it but it is well worth knowing this is just to explain a little bit of background Colin keeps his left arm very connected to the body on the way to the top of the backswing and he also bows his left wrist or keeps it in flexion he keeps that angle as he moves through the ball straightens his left leg aggressively and opens up the body to the target at impact and that combination allows him to play this nice little buttery fade what it also does when you start to swing down to the left-hand side, this can help steepen the angle of attack, making a ball and turf contact a little bit easier. So how can you better use some of these principles to strike the ball? Now, I've got some alignment sticks here. These are gonna be invaluable to understand this. Now, the first alignment stick I'm gonna lay on the ground and point directly at my target, which is a white flag in the middle of the range here at the L squad. So I've pointed that down at my target, and then what I'm also gonna do is I'm gonna move another alignment stick in here and point it to the left. Now this is gonna symbolize what my club path is going to do through the ball. So when a golfer hits a successful fade, the club is gonna be moving left of target line. So traveling in that direction there, and the club face is gonna be open to that path, but close to target. So it's gonna be aiming pretty much in between these two alignment sticks. Now to practice this pure strike, all I'm gonna be doing is first of all, setting my body up parallel along my target line. I'm then just gonna open up my body slightly so it aims a little bit to the left, down onto the golf ball, and then traveling left along the inside alignment stick. An extra added thing you can do to make this more Colin Morikawa is just get a little bit of material, tuck it underneath that left armpit and feel like the left arm is a little bit closer to the body throughout the technique that keeps the arms connected with the body turns. Lining up to the target, moving the body slightly to the left, then swinging through, just trying to get that club face lined up in between these two alignment sticks. That is prime. Guys, if you are on your phone, make sure you take a screenshot of this video. Also, if you do want to carry on learning, you do want to strike the ball better, here's another video that you can carry on to watch. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. We'll see you next time.